Our planet, a sphere of vibrant life, holds hidden forces beneath its surface. These forces, constantly shifting and interacting, sometimes make themselves known in a dramatic display, the earthquake. Imagine the ground suddenly moving beneath your feet, a tremor that can range from a gentle sway to a violent jolt. This is the power of an earthquake, a reminder that our seemingly solid earth is always in motion. These seismic events, as they are known, can reshape landscapes and leave a lasting impact on both nature and human lives. Earthquakes vary greatly in their strength. Some are so small they go unnoticed, detectable only by sensitive instruments. Others release bursts of energy so powerful they can level cities and trigger devastating tsunamis. The study of earthquakes, known as seismology, helps us understand these events and the forces that drive them. By unraveling the mysteries of earthquakes, we can learn to better prepare for their impact and build safer, more resilient communities. To grasp the nature of earthquakes, we must first journey beneath the Earth's surface. Imagine our planet as a giant jigsaw puzzle, its surface composed of massive interlocking pieces called tectonic plates. These plates, far from being static, are in constant, albeit slow, motion. They drift atop a layer of partially molten rock, moving at a rate comparable to the growth of your fingernails. The boundaries between these tectonic plates are where most earthquakes occur. As the plates grind against each other, immense pressure builds up over time. This pressure can be released suddenly, like a snapping rubber band, sending shock waves through the earth. These shock waves are what we feel as earthquakes. The point within the earth where this energy is first released is called the focus, or hypercenter, while the point directly above it on the surface is the epicenter. Not all plate boundaries move in the same way, leading to different types of earthquakes. When two plates collide head-on, one may be forced beneath the other in a process called subduction. This grinding and scraping can generate the most powerful earthquakes. Imagine the colossal forces at play as these massive plates collide, reshaping the very foundation of our world. In contrast, when plates slide horizontally past each other, they can get stuck building up pressure that is eventually released as an earthquake. These strike-slip earthquakes, while potentially very strong, are generally less powerful than those caused by subduction. And in areas where plates move apart, molten rock rises from the Earth's interior, creating new crust and causing earthquakes in the process. Understanding these different types of plate boundaries helps scientists predict where earthquakes are most likely to occur. History is replete with stories of devastating earthquakes that have reshaped landscapes and left indelible marks on human civilization. One such event occurred in 1906 in San Francisco, USA. A massive earthquake, estimated at a magnitude of 7.9, ripped through the city, toppling buildings and igniting fires that raged for days. It stands as a stark reminder of nature's raw power and the importance of preparedness. In 2011, the Tohoku earthquake off the coast of Japan with a magnitude of 9.0 unleashed a devastating tsunami that swept across the coastline, causing widespread destruction and claiming thousands of lives. These events, etched in our collective memory, underscore the importance of understanding earthquakes and their potential impact on our world. Section 5, Nature's Response, Humanity's Challenge, Earthquakes, beyond their destructive potential, are also a reminder of the dynamic forces that shape our planet. They can uplift mountains, carve out valleys, and alter the course of rivers. The Earth's crust, far from being static, is constantly being molded and reshaped by these seismic events. For human societies, earthquakes pose a significant challenge. Buildings crumble, infrastructure collapses, and lives are tragically lost. The aftermath often brings further hardship, displacement, disease and the daunting task of rebuilding. Yet from these tragedies we also witness the remarkable resilience of the human spirit. Communities come together to support one another, demonstrating courage, compassion and an unyielding will to rebuild. Section 6. Staying safe when the ground trembles. While we cannot prevent earthquakes, we can take steps to mitigate their impact and protect ourselves. 
Understanding the risks and knowing how to respond during and after an earthquake can be the difference between life and death. One crucial aspect is being prepared, having an emergency plan in place, knowing evacuation routes and securing heavy objects in your home can significantly reduce risks. During an earthquake, the safest course of action is often to drop, cover and hold on. This means dropping to the ground, taking cover under a sturdy piece of furniture and holding on until the shaking stops. If you are outdoors, move away from buildings, power lines and trees. After an earthquake, be aware of aftershocks, which are smaller earthquakes that can occur in the hours, days, or even weeks following the main event. Staying informed through reliable sources, such as official government alerts, is crucial during these times. Section 7. Rebuilding and Learning, Adapting to Earth's Power. The aftermath of an earthquake presents a monumental challenge but also an opportunity to rebuild smarter and stronger. Engineers and architects continuously strive to design more earthquake-resistant structures, using innovative materials and techniques to withstand seismic forces. Beyond infrastructure, education plays a vital role, teaching communities about earthquake preparedness, promoting awareness of potential hazards and fostering a culture of safety are essential steps in mitigating risks. By understanding the science of earthquakes, respecting the power of nature and working together, we can create safer and more resilient communities for generations to come. Section 8. Respecting the forces that shape our world. Earthquakes, while potentially destructive, are an integral part of our planet's natural processes. They are a reminder of the immense forces at work beneath our feet, constantly shaping and reshaping the world we know. By studying these events, we gain a deeper understanding of our planet's dynamic nature and our place within its grand scheme. As we learn more about earthquakes, we develop a greater appreciation for the delicate balance of life on Earth. We recognize the importance of respecting the natural world, living sustainably, and working to mitigate our impact on the environment. By understanding the forces that shape our planet, we can better prepare for the future and ensure a safer, more sustainable world for generations to come. Section 9. Life endures a testament to resilience. Earthquakes may shake our world, but they also reveal its remarkable resilience. Life in its myriad forms has adapted to thrive in even the most seismically active regions. From deep sea creatures that inhabit hydrothermal vents along plate boundaries, to plants that flourish in earthquake prone regions, life finds a way. The human spirit too exhibits remarkable resilience in the face of such adversity. Communities band together, rebuilding their lives and supporting one another. From the ruins, hope emerges, a testament to the enduring strength of the human spirit. Earthquakes, while a powerful force of nature, remind us of the importance of knowledge, preparedness and collective action. By understanding these events and working together, we can create a safer and more resilient future for all.